Hi everyone. Somebody requested a treat haul, so I wanted to do an update with that for you. So let's jump right on in. This is what they received uh, over the holidays for Christmas. We've been enjoying the Bocce's Bakery treats, and these are their crunchy ones. So they have the chicken here. I took them out the box and put them in their drawers in the back here in their treat drawer from their for their dresser. But I wanted to keep the box so you can see. And we got these off Amazon. Um, so here's the chicken. And then they are trying the banana and peanut butter. Or peanut butter and banana. And then their favorite, cheese please. Which they generally only get um, for Christmas. And then once they're out, we sort of wait to restock again. But they do enjoy this one a lot. And they get this at night. I'll show you. These are already in my little jars in the back so this is as far as my dresser drawer can open so i'll have to pull things out all right let's start from this side these are the little blueberry the good dog blueberry bones i use these the most when they're taking pictures of um when i had them modeling for the dog bows and they also get these at night with their cheese please if they don't have cheese please it's some sort of other cheese treat that they'll get it with. So a blueberry and a cheese is what they get at night before bedtime. These two are empty. They had, uh, oh, they have one in here. Okay, I need to give that to either Paris or B. But those were the, um, oh my gosh, Fruitables, right? Is that what they're called, Fruitables? They, I used to get them at PetSmart, but and then I would get them on Amazon, and I had them for so long. Most of these jars were for, uh, filled with Fruitables, but then we switched over to Bocce's, and we found out about Bocce's through the um, Bark Box. We ordered one box one time, and they had it in there, and they loved it. So we've just been sticking with Bocce's ever since. So um, these are empty, but um, well, except for this one. But I'll restock this with something else later. This... Uh, let's just go here. <laughs> Bisous, um, was it Bisou? Maybe it was Paris's birth. Yeah, it had to be Paris. I believe it was for Paris's birthday, which is in October. Um, she got these treats again, Bocce's. And I think some of these flavors are limited edition. They're not always going to be there. Um, they tried one of their soft and chewies, so they love anything soft and chewy they go for or a jerky type of treat. Um, I just prefer not to give them too many of these because of the tartar buildup and things like that they can get. Paris just... <laughs> Let me see if I can film her. She literally just busted into the room. She heard me fooling around in here. Mommy. And I'm sorry she's a hot mess. I'm doing this before I do her face wash. <laughs> What's up there, huh? I'm showing everyone your treats. Yes, I am. What is that behind you? Oh, that's a leaf. Okay, we're safe. I thought that was a, a poopy. Okay, I'll give you one if you're quiet, okay? Let me finish. Alright, so... Uh, the burgers and fries, I believe these were crunchy and they were limited edition. So were the buffalo wings and they enjoy all of them. They eat these up. But for sure, for sure, they really do like the soft and chewy. So they get this as a really special reward if they do something good or I need them to listen to me. Um, Old Mother Hubbard. These are the peanut butter treats that Paris really goes nuts over. They're the size small, which you can see in here, they're pretty big for a dog um, for Paris and Bisou size. But what I do is I crack it in half and I give it to them and we call this her big treat. And she looks forward to getting these um, at night. Well, as a, not before they get their blueberry and cheese treats, but probably after they eat dinner, they she'll ask for her peanut butter a uh, big treat there um, and they don't get these treats like dished out to them all day throughout the day they I alternate through these and they last me quite some time um, these are some leftover of the bocce's cheese treats again if I don't have the cheese please we go for a different brand of for cheese and this is what they have left over for that so we're still going through this before they can um, 
start on their cheese, please. So then in here, in this massive jar, are the big treats. And then they, I crack them in half. You can kind of see here, it's easy to crack. I crack it in half and they each get a half and, and they get that. You hear her crying? Maybe not. This one, okay, this is the, the bocce uh, chicken. That, that's what this is here. See how it's filled up? I haven't even really given this, this to them yet. Let's see. And I even cracked these in half. So they each get a small portion. So I really try to limit the amount of treats they get. Oh, here comes the other one. Let's see. Here we go. Okay. Would you like a treat? Thank you. Yeah, they love those. And this is normal for B. She will not eat her treat. Okay, make me look bad. She'll usually sit there and wait for Paris to be done because Paris is a pig. And um, she knows Paris wants to eat her treat. So she'll wait for Paris at, to finish hers. And she sort of teases her by holding off eating her own treat. And then she'll snatch it and run so Paris can't get it. Oh, the joys of two. All right. And here, I believe, are the peanut butter, banana peanut butter. So this one... That's what this is. Pretty dark, same size. I've given them a couple of these already just to see how they like it and they enjoy them. And then this is cheese, please. Which they look like, oops, they look like little crackers. And they're, I believe it's nothing but the cheese is the only ingredient. So yeah, they really, really like this. Oh, Tommy. I'm terrible. You see, she cries, I give in. It's, I'm sorry. I'm a bad mommy. Here, I'm trying to find a small one. Oh, here comes the other one. Oh, Lord. Here, y'all just get, let's see. You like when I film these kind of videos, huh? Oh yeah, you see she had no time to waste there. She went right for it. Four paws up for that one, right? They really love cheese, please. Yeah, you love that one, huh, B? Yes, you do. Oh, she's trying to steal whatever Paris hasn't eaten yet. Okay. So, that was cheese, please. Let's see if I can step over her. And... And this, this is uh, um, this last one here is what normally is the blueberry. So I have nothing but crumbs in here. So what I do is I just those little broken pieces that are solid. I'll give that to them, and then I'll just empty that uh, box into here. I just haven't gotten around to doing it yet. Uh, they should be modeling bows in a couple of days, so. I need to get to doing this. So that's pretty much it. That's what we've, that's standard for us over the last maybe six months. This is the only thing they've been getting. Uh, whatever Bocce's has out. Um, basically the repeat of Bocce's, we always do their chicken. We always do their cheese a flavor if we don't have a cheese please. And then definites are the cheese please, the good dog, blueberry, and the peanut butter. And then the, all the others we rotate flavors. So, just wanted to update you guys since it was requested. So, this is their treats, and they really love them. So, thanks for watching.